Estonia rolled back its plan to establish a national cryptocurrency S-coin following criticism from the president of the European Central Bank, Mario Draghi, and local banking authorities. Bloomberg reported June 1. The managing director of the Estonian e-residency program, Kaspar Korges proposed the development and issuance of S-coin in August last year. Along with becoming Estonia's national virtual currency, S-coin would ostensibly evolve into the official currency for the country's e-residency program. In the program S-Coin would serve as an incentive for foreigners who use Estonia's electronic identification to remotely sign documents and found companies. Draghi said in September, No member state can introduce its own currency. The currency of the Eurozone is the Euro. S-Coins will now only be given as an impetus to e-residents, according to SIIM Sikit an official in charge of the country's IT strategy, Sikit said in an interview with Bloomberg. We agreed in discussions with politicians that S-Coin will proceed as a means for transactions inside the A-resident community. Other options aren't on the table. We're not building a new currency, Gorgeous confirmed Sikha's statements, saying that community S-Coin is still being analyzed. He added that S-Coin would definitely not be a national cryptocurrency. Draghi's position was supported by Governor of the Bank of Estonia Ardo Hansen, who complained about misleading reports on S-Coin from government agencies. Governments and central banks in various countries have been considering the potential of national or central bank-issued digital currencies. Earlier this month, Norway's central bank, Norges Bank, announced it is considering the development of its own digital currency as a supplement to cash to ensure confidence in money in the monetary system. The Federal Council of the Government of Switzerland recently requested a study investigating the risks and opportunities of introducing its own state-backed digital currency or so-called e-franc. Romeo Lacker, the author of the research proposal, said that an e-franc under the control of the central bank would create a lot of synergies, so it would be good for the economy. Thank you for listening to my channel. Please subscribe for get hot news in the world.